Osan's public health flight set aside two days to administer the flu mist to active duty service members. The Department of Defense sends the flu mist to active duty bases first to ensure military personnel are protected from the virus. Uh, we want to get it into the nose or to the arm of the person. And what this will do is it will keep us from having uh, severe influenza effects later on. Because our season would run from November to March, so the sooner we get it in the nose and arm, the better off we are to keep us all healthy. Osan's goal is to reach 100% by the Thanksgiving holiday. Since administering the flu mist is much easier than the flu shot, medical personnel will be able to accommodate to more of the active duty population in a shorter period of time. You can also uh, can train people to deliver the mist relatively quickly, whereas giving a, an IM injection is you need to be a health care provider or an IDMT to, to get it done. Osan vaccinated nearly 3,500 people at the end of two days, primarily using the flu mist. I hardly ever get sick. So even when I take the mist or the shot, it really doesn't affect me. Um, other than that, I mean, it, that's what the Air Force wants. I'm just by by the rules. If you want to make it through the flu season without making a trip to the doctor's office, make sure you get your immunization. Air Force Sergeant Sandra Bradley, Osan Air Base, Korea.